Chicago police officers and told them what was going on and went on about his business. But he saw the car in the 100 block of West Chicago Avenue. No driver, but a little girl in the back seat. The parents are relieved. Ahmad said it, he's calling it his good deed of the day. WBBM News Time 508. Traffic and weather together on the Eats, sponsored by Elmhurst BMW. And good morning to Bo Duran. Well, good morning, Nick Young. On the Edens inbound, it's 19 minutes from Lake Cook into the junction and back out. The Kennedy inbound just 20 minutes in from O'Hare this morning. 10 minutes in from Montrose so far. The outbound side just 10 out to the junction, 20 out to O'Hare. Inbound Ike, 29 minutes from Thorndale into downtown and 16 in from Mannheim with no outbound issues. The Stevenson inbound going to be sluggish from Ashland in to the Dan Ryan. It's 30 minutes, or rather 33 minutes from 355 into Lakeshore Drive and 20 minutes, uh, 23 minutes in from the Tri-State there. The outbound side, a bit of a slowdown as you approach 355 with some road work there, but no major issues at 32 minutes out to 355. The northbound side of I-55 still have the jackknife semi. It's the northbound side of 55 just past Route 20 where you have the two right lanes are blocked because of a jackknife semi and a bit of a delay in the area there. That's northbound 55 just past I-80. The southbound side of I-55 looking okay though. The Dan Ryan at 15 minutes between 95th and downtown either direction you go. 57 with no major delays to report on the Bishop Ford. Inbound you're looking alright so far. The outbound side of crash uh, on the exit ramp to Sibley has that ramp blocked. Lakeshore Drive all clear both north and southbound. On the southbound side of the Tri-State Toy there's a stall near Lake Cook Road. It's blocking the left center lane. The Jane Adams, Reagan and 355 are okay. 80 and 8094 along with the Indiana Toll Road and I-65 looking good so far. A couple of spots of uh, lights flashing red in the city. One in the loop on LaSalle and Wacker. Also at Central and Madison, lights are flashing red there as well. And uh, closure continues in Lake Forest. Highway 41 remains blocked between Route 60 and Wesley. That's because of debris. Get traffic and weather together on the 8s every 10 minutes on News Radio 780 at 105.9 FM. More summer weather ahead today after a stormy night. Uh, windy and warm sunshine, a few clouds mixed in. About a high of 80 degrees for this afternoon. Then partly to mostly cloudy overnight, breezy, and a uh, reality check. Uh, the mercury falls to 44 degrees tomorrow, mainly cloudy, breezy. Much, much cooler, though, with the possibility of some rain toward evening. Tomorrow's high, only 58 degrees, cooler at the lakefront. Uh, much warmer than that this morning, Joliet checks in with 73 degrees. 72 at O'Hare, Midway, and at the lakefront again. We're headed for an afternoon high of 80. WBBM News Time, 510. Right now at Elmhurst BMW, lease the new 2017 BMW X3 X-Drive 28i for only $4.19 per month for 36 months with no security deposit. $43.44 due at signing. Visit the luxury leader at ElmhurstBMW.com. There are paint projects 